when the ship is first wrecked, you're drowning with wreckage all around you. Everything floating around you reminds you the beauty and magnificence of the ship that was and is no more. And all you can do is float. You find some piece of the wreckage and you hang on for a while. Maybe it's a physical thing. Maybe it's a happy memory or a photograph. Maybe it's someone who is also floating. For a while, all you can do is float. Stay alive. In the beginning, the waves are 100 feet tall and they crash over you without mercy. They come 10 seconds apart and you don't even give, get time to catch your breath. All you can do is hang on and float. After a while, maybe weeks, maybe months, you'll find that the waves are still 100 feet tall, but they come further apart. When they come, they still crash over you and wipe you out, but in between, you can breathe. You can function. You never know what's going to trigger the grief. It might be a song, a picture, a street intersection, the smell of a cup of coffee. 